Uh, I've definitely amped up, you know, the lies of social media to hype not just myself, but yes, of course, my page, because that's how you kind of bait clients, sorry to say. No, but I'd like to say when uh, naturalista's trend became a thing, I tried to take better care of my hair and post more often about uh, being a naturalista. Maybe filters? Like, maybe, uh, nowadays we get a dark filter, like, okay, that filter, if it looks good on that person, I can use it. So I once saw a montage of Naomi Campbell together with Tara Banks, and I thought, um, since I got the body and all the right features, I was like, ah, I can try to be a model. The only one challenge I've ever done was for work. It was for a work video promo. But for my own, never done even one challenge. Maybe posting things after the fact, like let's say I went on a holiday like a year before, you don't know. You don't know it was the year before, but it was. Um, and I'd be sitting, you know, at work, kind of like just like bummed out or something, or sitting at home doing nothing. So you'd assume I'm like out and about and doing all of these things, but I'm really not. So yeah, I've, I've done that before for sure. If I was in my early 20s, ah, I'm sure I'll have been doing enough of the trends. For years, I hid the fact that I have this big mane and fro and everything. I hid it behind braids and everything else. And now we had a platform and I jumped on it. So I took 10 photos and actually posted them on Instagram. And they, they were successful. At the same time, they were not. So I was the light all that I can be a model. This is just a sample of what to expect in the Overreact podcast. Be sure to tune in this Monday from 10 p.m. on Capital FM. You can also listen to it online via Capital FM Kenya on Google and Apple Podcast and Sister Speaks Global on Google Podcast, Anchor and Spotify.